to another vlog. Okay, it is, um, the 28th day of December, 2021. <laughs> wow. Um, so this is my first day back after the break. I don't know, I was just saying to my coworker, it doesn't feel like a break, it feels like it was a weekend. A busy weekend at that. So I don't feel any more relaxed than I did before, but I'm back. So I'm here today for one client and to clean. So sometimes I book a client on my day off, just one client, and it's for a purpose. It's because I need to get myself up, I need to get myself going, and I need to get in here and do something. So today it was clean. I knew I needed to clean. Uh, the last week before Christmas was busy. And Christmas Eve, I finished my clients, I did my own nails, and I walked out the door. The file was still laying on the table. I left everything. I don't do that very often. So I wanted to come in this morning and clean, and I packed up, you're on a ring light right now. I packed up my other ring light. I have one that usually sits here, like beside, um, I can't make that happen, beside my mirror. And I did pack that up. I'm not using it. And I have often thought, you're still rocking back and forth. <laughs> Sorry. I've often thought it would be really cool to have one at home again because I used to have that one at home. Anyway, taking it back home. Hopefully I don't regret that decision. Oh, from cleaning, my hands are so dry. They're like almost itchy. Okay, let's lay my mask down so that's ready when my client comes in, but I wanna go through a haul with you. Also, I have the best clients. So I was cleaning and I heard the door open and I was like, mm -hmm. Who's that? Anyway, I go out and it's one of my clients and she brought me hot chocolate. And she's such a good friend. My ringer is still on. That's okay. All right, so this is an AR nail supply order. So Michelle and I went together on the order. She already has her, um, her I was gonna say her prizes because I'm opening this. She already uh, has all of her things. She ordered some Ugly Duckling gel, um, like core gel and Oh, Ephesian paints. Um, black or white? The opposite of what I got. So whatever that is. Hold on. Yes. So I got the Fusion Black because I am running out of my Glarabelle's Unbelievable Gels Black. So I got the Fusion Paints Black because that is really comparable. Um, so I did get that. But she sent me the Werther's original, as always, and whatever this is. Hearts, stars, flakes. So many shapes in here. And I don't know if you're gonna be able to see it because it's like wicked shiny. Isn't that cool? So thank you, Kathy, I love that. Okay, um, let's, let's start with all these things first. So, I have two cat eyes. I don't know what made me think I needed cat eyes. Well, I do know because I keep not buying them. Like I keep saying, oh no, I don't need that or whatever. And then <laughs> Michelle has a bunch and I keep using hers <laughs> because I come across these designs where I'm like, oh, that would be super cool on top of a cat eye. Um, but the only cat eyes I have are lime green and Oh God, do I have another weird color? Orangey maybe, sort of? So this one is Wildflowers Cat Eye Gold slash Fuchsia. So we'll see. I don't know if I need to put like a, ooh, that's pretty. Okay, so we'll see what that looks like later. And I also have white, white cat eye. So I was super pumped about this because I feel like it would be a really great base for nail art. And there's kind of that design going around right now that is like the shiny in the middle. I don't know what's up with that, but what time is it? Okay, I still have time. Um, two packages of files, the Ugly Duckling files, you guys know. I better leave these out. Actually, I may as well leave all of them out. I'll put them right in my drawer. And the next thing I have, drum roll please, while I throw everything around is the Beanie Scarlet Situation. The reds, and they're so 
stinking beautiful. Um, I'll put a picture of the collection. Um, are they named? I don't think they're, are they named? Color R06, cream gel polish, color R04. I don't think they're named. Okay, so aside from my black, these are the only beamy gel polishes I've ever had. I am gonna swatch them um, so that people can see them. I've done so terrible with my swatching. I don't even know now what swatched and what isn't. I used to swatch new stuff as it came in and I don't anymore. <laughs> okay, so that's it for my haul. Oh, other than I did, and not from AR, I did order a Young Nails uh, Protein Bond because like one of my favorite things. So I'm gonna put my bag away and put my stuff away. Uh, haven't got much time for her before my client comes, so I'll get ready for her and then we'll talk later. All right, guys. Y'all ready for this? Okay. Something needs to happen here because I have more glitter bells coming. I have more pots coming. And I still have, so during the holidays, I had, like during fall, I had fall colors out here on these two guys. During the holidays, I have had reds and greens and blues out there. So the reds and the neutrals, there you go, that I was using have stayed on this first one. And the blues and greens and kind of like jewel tones that I was using were staying on the second one. Just makes it so much easier if I'm bringing down the colors that I'm using a lot of. So I haven't quite decided January, February, what colors am I using a lot of. I'm gonna leave quite a few of the reds down because you guys just seen that I got the new Beanie Beauty Red Collection. So I wanna keep that up because it's stunning. But some of those need to come back to their home up here obviously. These lackets are going to have to go up. The colors that are here are going to have to go back in the door. No big deal. Um, but yeah, everything's working its way up because I don't have space. And I do have these. Let's turn this a little bit. I do have these here and I, they really don't need to be here. Um, some of them do. Some of them are top coats and that's cool. But some of them do not need to be here. This stuff up above doesn't need to be here necessarily either. But at the same time, who wants to be reaching clear to the top shelf every time that they need something? So I am going to do some rearranging low key. And then when my new stuff gets here, then I'll be able to like finalize it. It's really hard to finalize where everything's going to go without the new stuff. But if I wait till the new stuff gets here, I'm going to be busy off my feet and I'm going to throw it down on my little desk here and it's going to get sloshed around and that's not going to make me happy. So let's start by getting these off of here and getting them put in the drawer. They're so dirty. I'm not even going to worry about it. I'm going to do a rearrange of those later. I'm not terribly concerned about them right at the moment. I'm just not in the like groove of doing colored acrylic nail art right now. I'm just going to throw them in. When the mood strikes me again, I'll clean out those drawers and we'll make them more usable. But for the meantime, they can just go in. Okay, that's one shelf of them, which should be okay for me now. I'm also going to bring up all of the lackets and put them back up here, regardless of whether they were in my seasonal, because, because I need to know I have enough room up here for everything. So, red, 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 red. I'm not 
doing different reds and I'm not sorting them that way. I'm just sorting them by color. Uh, orange. Let's make sure I'm dealing with all of them here. I have black and white there. I generally keep the lacquer black and white down lower because I do, I do use them a fair amount. So black and white go down there. There's actually, I have three whites, one black. It's fun. Uh, so red, orange, yellow, green, green, sort of green. perfectly. So you know that means I'm going to find two more floating around, right? Because these fit perfectly. Um, okay, so the ones that are going to move up are going to be the neons. There's one here that's running all over the place. Yeah, so I'm going to move the neons up first because, well, it's January and are people going to be using neons? Probably. But that just seems to make the most sense. Wow, that one looked out really bad. Such a bad Especially like orange, neon orange. Not like a huge color right now. Oh wait, let's blow the dust up. Cover your ears. Greens. Yellows. Yeah, they don't need to be down here right now. Uh, that is super, super, super light blue, like called spearmint yeah it's beautiful but like it just I just probably don't need it right now yellow I'm surprised at how many yellows I actually have okay now let's go down here no those are all good so they don't need to go up 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 so then let's go for like the ones I don't use as much so this is like shattered silver so it's like little shards of silver I'm not using that right now it's not my favorite white let's put the white up there because i don't actually use the glitter bells white like a ton not because i don't like it mainly because i just have so many others so we're gonna keep um gosh how do i want to do this this is so hard i want everything to be within reach is the thing Bright blue. I'm not as likely to use bright blue right now. So let's move these over and then up. We'll start moving things up. It's another bright orange. Doesn't need to be. I put it in kind of on its side because it didn't really fit. It's one of those things where there's like enough room for like a half a bottle, so you end up putting it in sideways. Whoop, focus, whoop, whoop, uh, moving around. Um, things are looking up. I'm gonna move a lot of the reds back up. Bring the reds up. But then I'm gonna start bringing the blues and greens back up because they just don't need to be there anymore. A couple of them were ugly ducklings, so they're going back where they half live. That's a few. I'll move this artistic back to where it came from. Where did it come from? Uh, what's this? Okay, so that's a repeat. Okay, so I'm gonna leave that the way it is for right now. There is more that can happen there, but not today. That's not a job for today. So I've gotten as far as I feel like I can get without actually having the product in hand. So when the product comes, then I just feel like I have more control over where everything's going. Um, I still haven't tried the new cat eyes yet, but I figure I'll try them in like some January content um, for Instagram and we'll see how they work out. I also can redo my own nails in another week or so. I just put them on Christmas Eve, so I don't really want to mess with that just yet. Um, but yeah, that's going to be it for today and that's actually going to be it for this vlog. If you enjoyed this vlog please comment down below ask me any questions i will do my best to answer them and i really hope you had a wonderful holiday and i hope that your january is great <laughs>